Oh my god! 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 Oh my What's up, YouTube? Uh, before we get into the video, I wanted to make an announcement. I already did it on Twitter, so if you haven't followed me on Twitter, go follow me on Twitter. But I wanted to say we are officially partnered with G Fuel, and I couldn't be more excited. Thank you to literally everyone that watches my videos. You guys are amazing. Everyone that watches the Twitch, I can't thank you guys enough, seriously. So if you do like G Fuel or you haven't tried it already, I do have a code that you guys can use and a link in the description. You just go to Effective for 10 to 30% off in the store. If you don't know what G Fuel is, it is a powder-based or a can-based energy drink. Hope you stay focused, get your reaction time up, and get you ready to game. I've been drinking this stuff for over five years, and it's a dream come true that I actually got to be able to be partnered with them. So once again, thank you guys. Let's get into the video. What is going on YouTube? It's your boy Effective here bringing you another video here today. And shout out to you guys. We're so close to 10,000 subs. So if you aren't already subscribed, subscribe to the channel. We are so close. But in today's video, we're going to be talking about Activision's new anti-cheat. They updated it. We're going to go over the methods that they used. So Activision came out with a statement. They said they built mitigation methods like hallucinations to help piss off cheaters who are trying to use additional banned tools in the game. So for example, they use, let's say, aimbot and the game detects that. And then they use a fake image of, let's say, my player. And then they shoot at him. Then their gun goes away. In theory, it sounds very good. They said they already updated the game to do that, and it has not worked. Unless I'm mistaken and they haven't updated the game already, I've only ran into multiple, like, dozens of hackers per day when I stream, and it's actually insane. And what's on screen right now, I'm going to read word for word. If you guys want to pause to read it also, you can. So Activision says, hallucinations can be hidden and positioned anywhere relative to a suspicious player in the world as shown in an example above the team can place the hallucination near a suspicious player forcing them to self-identify as a cheater if they engage with the cloned character in any way like hallucinations as a mitigation the character model displays legitimate data when viewed in cheats and will also trigger things like aimbots now they say why did we build the hallucinations this mitigation the first but foundational step and one of many efforts to combat the community refers to as non-rage hackers. These are cheaters using prohibited tools for additional in-game information, giving them an unfair advantage against other players. Using these tools is against our security and enforcement policy and will result in account bans. I mean, I get what Activision is trying to do, but hackers been a thing for the past three years in Call of Duty, ever since crossplay got added to the game. As a competitive player myself, I'd love it to go back to console for just competitive, but they won't do that because crossplay brings too many players to the game and it'll bring back self-sided console worlds again. So like PlayStation has Call of Duty rights. So like it would be competitive for only PlayStation whereas Xbox players can't play with us or gets us, they have to buy a PlayStation to get one or vice versa for an Xbox. I just hope Activision can get it right and stop these hackers from getting more outrageous as this new season has said and shown for us. Like I said, me streaming maybe four hours a day, I run into 12 plus hackers every time and it's getting ridiculous. But I'm gonna leave you guys with the rest of the video. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. I don't know if this has helped you guys. I hope you guys want to play the game again. If not, I'm still here. I'm still going to be playing it. So yeah, guys, this has been your boy, Effective AK Dallas. Talk to you guys later. Peace out. Whoa. Yeah, I think Vanished. What the fuck was that? Oh, yeah, he's, he's aimbotting. He's, he's hard aimbotting. Uh, maybe hacker number five, six, and seven. We'll see. We'll see. These guys are like... I think two alley. Oh, one hit. Relocating. Stand by. No. Wait, this guy's looking at me through the fucking wall, bruh. But motherfuckers wall banging. That guy was wall banging me. Here comes the toggle. This motherfucker just pre-fired me, bro. Oh, bro, I hate people. Mm. <clears throat> 
Uh, yeah, if if one if anything this this nutchy guy is 100% cheating. He's walling. That's a that's a that's a given. I spawn in Narnia. Oh, he's fucking one shot. Nice. Good trades. One's back alley. I saw him laying down. Nice, Zaps. Go off, brother. Look at him trying to shoot me through the wall. <laughs> like, these guys are, like, really bad hackers. <clears throat> like, they're gonna have to turn it up even worse for them to actually beat us. He actually almost had the meat slam right there. Location updated. Capture the hard point. You're from back alley. One top ten. Oh. This guy might have turned it up. He, he might have turned it up, boys. That guy might have turned it up. Challenge, that guy's one shot. Challenge. Give me a bitch. There we go. That's good. No. It's actually nuts how close this is. I got three fired and he just lost the gunfight. He actually, he actually has. Oh. Bottom floor. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna win this, boys. Get laid down fast enough. Yeah. Oh, he's fucking mid, man. Uh. Man, it's not even like good aimbot like other people's. I guess I paid like 20 bucks for his. Hey, how you doing? So much in the ban on hackers at some time. Hello, how you doing, brother? How's your... Uh.